which topic is very important for learning English? Obviously, listening is the most important part to learning English. It's the most listening. Yeah, listening is the most important part. Because you are learning a language, it's not a subject. So listening is the most important part. Whenever you try to learn a, a language, you should uh, focus on listening. Because we have la la learned our mother tongue by only by listening. You have learned Bangla from your mother or father, from your brother or sisters. How? Just, for, just by listening. So listening is the most important part for learning English. You should focus on the listening part. So it's a big responsibility, you know. You have to maintain a class. <laughs> you have to uh, select a fine manager who will uh, collect fine, whoever speaks Bangla. You have to listen to the complaint, you have to give them a solution, you have to advise them, you have to uh, 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 write their problems, and you have to submit it to our uh, quality department, to our cycle sir, that's uh, we are facing this kind of problem. Uh, our students, are, they, are, uh, they will improve more if, they, if you uh, teach them like this way, if you teach them like this way. So you know, it's a huge responsibility. And whoever uh, will take this responsibility, uh, uh, I'm sure that he will learn something more, better than any other student. He learned how to be a good leader, how to be a good um, seer, plus representative, how to be a good captain, how to be a good person, obviously. What is your op opinion on grammar? Is necessary for uh, learn, uh, speaking English? Obviously, grammar is necessary. You cannot speak without grammar. You know, uh, you have to maintain the tense all, all the time. When you are uh, trying to say something that has, has been passed, you, use, you have to use past tense. Uh, you have to say uh, something uh, about your present, your present things. You have to use present sentence, and you have uh, you want to tell something that you will do uh, next. Yeah, the, you have to use a uh, future tense. So it's necessary to maintain the grammars, especially the tense, the speech, and uh, every uh, part of what is part of your speech. You have to maintain them to be a good speaker. So grammar is also important, as well as the listening, as well as you know. I have one debate. As my brother said, that grammar is necessary. But grammar is not necessary. Like, as he told that, how do we know Bangla? Our, from our mother, from our father, every kind of person uh, where we see from them. So, English is a, we have to see English just a language, not like grammar. If you like learn grammar, you will stuck in a maze. Like there will no, like, uh, you can't make sentences. Like, see our English teachers on school, on colleges. They can't speak English, but they're good at grammars. And they're not speaking fluently in English. They're just suggesting uh, this word will be that, dance, and like that. <laughs> so just follow the instruction and do whatever you want and speak English all the time. That can help you a lot.